inhaled air and ingested nutrients both past the oropharynx behind the oral cavity. A cartilaginous structure called the epiglottis directs the food and fluid away from the trachea and into the esophagus preventing inhalation of this material in the windpipe. The stem of the epiglottis is attaches to the anterior rim of the thyroid cartilage. The superior portion of the epiglottis can move freely and swing up and down like a trap door or a flap. With each swallow the larynx rises and epiglottis folds down over the laryngeal opening closing off the airway. If particles make their way into the trachea, coughing reflex pushes air forcefully up through the larynx forcing the particles out of the windpipe. Thank you.